Um, I was just disconnected. I never thought I would go through recruitment, so I went pretty close-minded, um, but ended up absolutely loving it. I just came from Colorado and I did not know a single person at all. I kind of didn't really have like a place at Belmont. I was kind of just roaming around and going to classes. Before I went through recruitment, I didn't have that many friends and I just I feel like I didn't have a place at Belmont. I just transferred to Belmont. I was just a clueless freshman that didn't really know what I was doing, but I was really excited for the next four years. I went through recruitment because my mom was in a sorority and she had an amazing experience, and so I thought I'd give it a try, but I didn't know I'd meet all of my best friends through this organization. I was just chilling at Belmont, didn't know what to do, <laughs> just sitting by a gazebo, <laughs> chilling by myself. <laughs> was actually a Theta and that's actually a really funny story. Um, I found her letters in my closet one day and I put them on and I came downstairs wearing them and she like yelled at me to take them off and I was like okay why? She's like you cannot wear the letters unless you're a Theta and I was like all right mom so I'll get the letters and that wasn't necessarily why I went through but I remember thinking that like during recruitment like I want letters like I want to feel a part of something and I want to feel prideful while wearing them so when I got them it was like this whole now I have a sweatshirt so <laughs> what I remember from Theta is not so much about Theta as it is what I remember about myself as I went through Theta when I listened to what I was saying in the Theta room I was I was like talking about who I really was and I wasn't trying to match what I thought they wanted. It, I was already being myself. Meeting the women, it's so funny going through recruitment and then being in the sorority after and you remember the women you talked to. And I just remember having the most intentional conversation where when they asked how your day was, when they asked how you're feeling and what you want to do with your life, they actually cared about the answer and it wasn't just to get to the next point or to use up the five minutes to talk. There's something really different about Theta and I just felt the authenticity with almost every conversation I had. I just felt so at ease and I was so intimidated by the whole process, really. And I remember walking in to the theater room and just, it was calm, it felt, it felt right. My college experience in life, if I had not gone through recruitment, I would not be at Belmont. I'm 100% sure I would have transferred. I wouldn't have felt like I was a part of a community. I can, I genuinely cannot imagine my life without it because I wouldn't I wouldn't have Mayor and I wouldn't have my best friends and I wouldn't have found my people and my people make my day every day. The women in Theta are just plain awesome. The women in Theta are so weird. <laughs> <laughs> They're so weird but I'm so weird so it makes me feel oh my gosh it makes me feel like I can be myself. We love to travel so if you want to come hang out with us and go on a hike or go to Europe, we're down. <laughs> so silly, it hurts, which is awesome. Here's the nights that you can't take back. We live hard, but we love to laugh. And we all thought that we'd get rich fast. Hop the plane out for greener grass. Found out the green is cash. Don't compare to the friends at last. See, we won't forget where we came from. The city won't change us. We the theater where Jonas Blair meets Nick. Oh, Kevin Jonas has a perfect life, and honestly, in theater, I feel like I have a perfect life. <laughs> Nick, have you like seen him lately? Because... Nick Jonas. Nick. If theater were a breakfast cereal, most definitely cinnamon life, because we are like fun and serious. Lucky charms. Honey Nut Cheerios. Because one, we're golden girls, we're great. Fruit Loops because they're all different colors and like I said, data is so diverse. We would be honey bunches of oats. I'm gonna tell you about it. We're granola. <laughs> but not all of us are granola. So we have those little sweet clusters in there as well. Oatmeal because it's not even a cereal. It's out of its own leaf. <laughs> and you can add all the like delicious stuff like we're sugar all, and fruit. We're and... all a different blueberry on top of this amazing <laughs> of oatmeal. 
the women in Theta are welcoming and they're silly and I just always feel like I can be myself on no matter what day it is, if it's a good day or a bad day. Um, I just feel really valued for who I am as a person. They're always there to pick you up when you're having a bad day. You can walk around campus anywhere and see a familiar face and your day is just instantly brightened. Theta to me is stability because classes change, friends change, housing assignments change, but you know Theta's always there. Theta is um, my family, my best friends, my people. Yeah, we always find our way back home.